What is up guys, we're back with a massive Bakugan opening and today I got majority of Wave 8, 9, whatever, I'm just going to say 8, Wave 8 Ultras and um, I do have Kelham but I'm not going to lie, I bought him and forgot to do video because I was that excited to open him because I had a feeling he'd come with the Lava Spray for my deck which he did come with the Lava Spray because I kind of figured since he was on that card's art but here is his character card, I'm just going to show that first I'm not going to get the figure because I'm a little bit lazy. Uh, blue shield, orange shield, 3-2, underdog when this opens. If you have a uh, blower B, then your opponent play Diamond Kellen for free. Which I believe is a 500 B, but 15 damage. So that's good for my Descendius decks right there. And this is the rest of the wave, excluding the Diamond Hyper Dragonoid. Which, at the Walmart, there was one of each of these and two Kellyons. So, uh, I guess the... What is that, 9 in his shipment? That's weird. I forgot, this wave has one extra ultra that's not a diamond. Usually there's 7 ultras and 1 diamond. This was just 8 with 1 diamond, but I guess there's 9 in the box, so Kellyon gets doubled up if there's no diamond. So it's going to be a tough one to find. I guess uh, let's just get started because this is going to be a lot. It's going to be a long video. I hate long videos, but guess what? I want to show you everything, and I know you guys like to watch this because we try to get over as quick as possible. So sorry for rambling on for a minute. We're going to start with Arliss Green and Mega Disappointment. He does not have the red eye. Very sad. They could have just gave him one little paint splodge on that face of his, and it would have just been done. That, that's it. Very, very simple. All right. Of course... What the? Okay, he wasn't tied down. He just flopped out, so I guess be careful. Just in case since they're not tied down, check for broken parts. I doubt it, but um, the distribution has been much better or just packaging on them, so um, anything's broken, maybe you should check that. But um, here he is. Oh, he looks really good with the silver, not going to lie, but I just wish he had that red eye. Actually, I know Gorin has no silver at all, like all the other uh, main faction, Arliss, Trino, him... Pyravian and the Tico we're never going to get. Minus one. Oh, a plus 300. Awesome. Always good to get plus 300s. They should just include those all the time. And this one's on tape down. And here is the... Oops. My bad. Goreen Ultra. Orange, green. 2-6. Underdog if it has uh, less than the opponent when it opens. Play Hyper Goreen Ultra for free. And you get Avalanche, which is the worst of the R list actions. Two for two, if you play three cards from factions, it's turn plus eight. You might as well just play um, Light's Courage and hope to win the first ball to have Domination for two for eight. So this is kind of disgusting. And it's actually a rare. I'm glad that it's a rare, not a common, because you'd see so much of these when you actually, if we actually get the packs soon. But we'll wait on that. So, um, yeah, if you guys heard of the big controversy where if the game ever gets too hectic and crazy, that they're... The plan might be to rotate out. Uh, let me know in the comments what you think about rotating. Uh, just just comment rotate or ban. A uh, ban slash limited list. Your personal opinion. Because this ended up in a Nerdy Friends live stream. This is how it started. So it's somewhat our fault. I'm just going to open and talk. Um, that um, uh, We were just saying, oh, I, I blinding inked. Roll, he blinding ink me, then I blinding ink back, and we kept blinding ink back and forth like in one turn. And I was like, wow, this needs to get hit to two or one or something. And then, someone who's talked to Justin Gary, one of the main, the main creator for this game, uh, uh, they got info on that from the, him saying that if the game ever got to high tech, they'd rotate out. And that started a giant war in the comment section. It was insane. I agree for a band slash limited, no rotating. But that is just me. Because this is a game where price, you don't get cash prizes, so... I believe a band slash limited is better because if you think about it, if it was rotating and they're just getting a little Dragonoid cost special edition to win, then um, you get rotated out. You just spent like almost what like hundreds, maybe up to thousands, depending on which box and which cards you get. It's assuming if your deck wants to be all shiny to look cool, you might have to spend a lot. Give me a quick sec second. I need scissors. It's a good thing I brought some from home. Let's see. Yeet. There we go. All right. Our list little trino. Very cool. He actually looks better. Um, I don't mind that the eyes are green. Like, that's what stands out about him. But this actually is fine. It's, I just wish Goreen had his one red eye. I guess we'll fold him up. I did not roll out Goreen. I am sorry. I'm just, I've just been rambling. So, yeah, that's, uh, and then it started in a Bach and Facebook where they're thinking about, like, everyone's thinking, oh, like, this is going to turn a lot of players down if they rotate, which I think it will. But please, I hope they don't rotate. All the players are all the sets out and just reprint them like they do with Pokemon. I feel like just that's a waste of money, especially since it revolves around figures. And if they rotate all the cards out, all the figures you spent lots of money on 
are useless. Blue Shield, Helix, 3-6, Fierce Charge, good card. At least he came with that. Um, I guess I'll roll them out just so y'all guys can see them pop open. By the way, this is not a flat surface. I'm just doing this on the edge of my bed. <laughs> Whoa, he flew. Okay, cool. This one can fly and hold the core. The Aqua Sun sometimes struggles. He kind of yeets it or yeets off of it and then onto another one. I probably should have put more cores, right? I just dropped the core. It's gone. Oh, cool. He opened up. Did I not check his core either? He came with a minus two, minus two trap. And the blue shield was a plus 650. Awesome. We're getting good cores. These are actually, this is a good trap. I think it's a, uh, the other one for Helix is like a minus three plus one damage or a other words, the other way where it's a uh, plus 100 minus three damage, something like that. Okay. Not bad. Not bad. Let me just get some of the traps out of the way. That's what I get for joking around with the bad list. <laughs> oh man. I feel terrible. Eh, not really. It's good to bring this up now, so in the later in the future when they just drop it on us like nothing, um, now this time we have a chance to just possibly prevent a rotation from happening with enough people in the community just reach out, which is probably going to happen. They're going to listen to the older players. <laughs> what if the kids are like, oh, I don't care. They're like, oh, yep, kid friendly. Got to gotta go with the kids idea. Plus four for Darkest Aquas and a minus one plus four. That, is that new? I don't know. I don't care for those cores. All right. Fun fact, this is all recyclable, so recycle kids, it's good for you. And or if you don't care, then just throw it away. <laughs> as long as it's not just laying around. Shield Helix, 4-4. Four, four. Okay. Oh my god. No way, I knew it. This is why I picked up all of them. I knew they were going to have liquid darts. Finally, more liquid darts. I need like 10 more. Three costs plus four. If you have an Arliss, it costs two less. So it's a one for four, of course, if you're playing Arliss with it, which you better be. Um, this is not getting rolled out or closed because I don't like it. All right. Viserox, I know his stats. I know what he does. We just don't have his Evos to actually. Wow. Do anything magical yet. Is he tied down? I can't tell. Wait. What the? How did I expect this to take that out? I guess cut it from the back. There we go. Yeah, that was weird. That was too tight in my... Because I swore they just wrapped him around from the bottom legs, but... Yeah. Hey, a double green. Cool. We're getting a lot of double green aquas recently. Hydronoid, Hypertrox, plus 100, Darkest Aquas plus 3 damage. 150 plus 2. Yes. Good. Good course. And... He does have the underdog ability. I feel like this this is all underdog, everyone. Right? Gorin, this, and I know Kalion, and I think Tritonium too. Vice Rocks Ultra, double green, 3 4. This uh, opens, you may play Aquas Titan, Vice Rocks Ultra free, and the Aquas Titan, I believe it's a 4 cost, but it's a 9 4, or 9 5. So, eh. Hidden Treasure, okay. 1 cost, stop Arliss. If you do, you may draw 2 cards. If you pull this off, you're pretty much set. For one cost. Eat. Alright. Uh, I guess we'll get the one darkest out of the way. We're almost saying this one's okay. On the Evo. And uh, I think stats and cores. The trusty skizzers. Trash day is going to be a fun day. All right, a plus six hundred and a one fifty plus four. They were both off by one, like because the uh, other up is two fifty plus uh, three, and then this the other one's six fifty. So, whatever, kind of close. Cards. Sorry if I'm not rolling some of them again. I don't want to. I'm just trying to get this out of the way so you guys can see all the new stuff that you might not get in your area. Sorry for being so realistic. Blue shield, red fist, four two. Anchor strike, zero minus two. Okay, I believe he has a. Uh, will Victor discard a flip for plus five damage, plus four damage, and I don't. I think it's a two cost, and he's seven five, seven four. I know Raul's telling me this one's okay for uh, decent damage decks, but yeah, um, fine. I know you guys are saying roll it, close it in your head, so we'll just do Chunchanius. I just don't want to do the other two because I hate Phaedrus. Whoever designed it is is a monster, and calling that an ultra is 
us in. And, um, woo. Cool. It rolled. Yeah, I messed that up. That's my fault. Too bad. Hey, Astrotonium. Um, this one's pretty... I like how he has blue eyes. He looks normal. On here, he has yellow beady eyes. This freaked me out. I was like, that is an angry turtle. It looks so demonic. Even on the back of the package, he has yellow eyes. And there's all the other things in the wave. Wait, what? No way. There's ten Ultras in this wave? Are you serious? Wait, no way. Yeah! Oh my god, this wave has ten Ultras. 10 and they only put in nine per box no wonder diamond hyper drago this is going to be the rarest diamond of all time because they double kellyon for my shipment so if they're oh my god if vines of pyravian takes the place of the other kellyon what the hell unless this doesn't exist because i remember there was the error that uh i think it was scorpios pyrus came with ventus hyper pyravian's car yeah yeah i think i got it right here let's see I believe it is an Age of Arliss, which I already organized for spots. Yeah, we have it already. 6-3, red, green, love that lineup. Underdog, this opens, has less B-play, hyper private, no ultra free. What the hell? Okay. Um, I need that now. <laughs> okay, I'm missing this, Pandox, Scorporos, and um, all the minis. But all the, I'm almost done with the ultras for this entire uh, Battle Planet series. Excluding diamonds, because uh, eh, they come and go. Oh, that one opened up pretty quickly. But yeah, okay, never mind. There is another Bakugan. Keratonium in your package prison. Okay, there we go. I, it felt like I cut his arm off or like whatever that turtles have. Beat, I guess. All right. He is Orange Helix 4-5. Drumway 4. Attach a core from the field. If you have multiple... Eh, this is a terrible card. I'm sorry. Oh, you get Frost Strike, though. If it's Domination. Plus 3. Uh, plus 5, minus 1. Good core. And a plus 5. 150, plus 1. Short shot. Orange Shield. That's a, that's a weird lineup. Orange Shield Helix. Yeet. I caught on to Trino. Oh, yeah. You gotta pre-open him. I haven't closed him in forever, so... Okay. I guess we'll roll him out for fun. So, also, we should also reach out saying, um, will the fifth set of Bakugan contain the rest of the AA uh, sets of Evos? Because all these Ultras actually got Evos, but a lot from the three packs did not. Pyrus Fade Ninja, Arliss Fade Ninja, only the Ventus one, which is the cores. So... All the, the, the two waves of three packs, wave six, seven, seven, eight, whatever, they didn't get any Evos. A lot of them did not. So that's a real big, like, ugh, especially since a lot of the minis were good. Again, the Fade Ninjas. The blue one got his, but it's a diamond, so it's garbage. Unfortunately, that is the truth. Hashtag the truth, chaotic darkness. Final one. That is not the final one because I'm missing that, apparently. But, um, okay. I heard this one's pretty good. I believe it's the one. Oh yeah, he's good. Good stats. He's the one where I think he, uh, if you play a, is this one is it the Aquas? No, the Aquas is if you play like a Darkest Adventures, you get B. I think this one might have that ability too. This one's also packaged in really tightly. So, okay, got it. Okay. Oh, don't want to lose the eyeball. Oh, I thought I lost it already. I was like, oops. All right, you want to put the eyeball in there because I don't want to lose it. Okay, um, that's weird. Uh, the Arliss Clopdor, right? Arliss or no, Darkest, and this one actually have the spring and the hook, but the Arliss and the Aquas did not, or not Aquas. Yeah, it was just Arliss, the first released one, which I thought was weird. Of course, he can shoot it. This one doesn't work. Mine's effective. Oh, there we go. It does not stick out all the way actually, so I have to actually push it pretty hard. Yeah, look, the peg's not even like barely coming out. It's right there. You can't see it. Whatever. I'm not going to use that function. It has no in-game function. So, plus 50, plus 1, plus 250, plus 3. Cool. Clopter Ultra. All right. 6-1. Red-green for a Chaos. Uh, I don't think we have any red-greens for Chaos. Let me know. Uh, I, I, I'm just going to check my binders probably. But 
I doubt we have one with these stats. I don't think we actually do. We just have double green fist for like five chaos and then blue shield orange shield for like five other ones. All of Leo's Bakugan basically. Wait, yeah, Leo's Bakugan. Gorthion Ultra, Pegatrix Ultra have the orange shield, blue shield, and then the Gorthion Core and Pegatrix Core both have double green fist. Very original. Okay. Come on. Growing Giant. Okay, meme card. Let's go. Five costs, 900B. If you're holding most Bakugans though, plus 1500. So it's actually not bad. This is actually my fourth one because I got three from Detective for a trade. So thank you for that. So this one is the fourth one, which I kind of want to incorporate and make a domination deck with all these new hands popping and stuff. <laughs> I'm out of breath. Sorry, I'm talking way too fast. I'm trying to get over this real quick so I can organize all my stuff because I got a lot to do. Oops, I hit this the bag. But um, yeah, let me know what you like so far in here. I guess the coolest one for me was uh, Kalyon, I guess, just because it's Pyrus Kalyon. Uh, and Goreen. I like Gold Goreen. I just wish you had the Red Eye. And Trino. Basically anyone with their native faction. Oh yeah, and Vysox Ultra is also his native faction. Yeet. That's fun. But, yes. The big controversy, guys. Try to, let's try to make it so it's only a band slash limited list. Um, sorry. That's what we get for making jokes in a live stream. Saying blinding ink things to get hit to one or two. But guess what? Now we can actually try to fix this issue. By trying to get everyone in the community to say... Band slash limited or rotate, um, which I don't want rotating because then I just wasted, um, what is that? $65 just on one wave times X amount of waves per thing. I, I probably wasted like five grand if they rotate out this, the whole first, uh, Battle Planet line. So yeah, hope you guys like this uh, and see you on the next video. Thanks for watching.